My great granddad invented the rear view mirror for cars. After that, there was no looking back. Welcome to Shave and Butcher, and thanks to Martin at MMMV, MMMV Shaves for the joke. <clears throat> so, barrister and man, Fougere Gothique. Unfortunately, no music from Lord Shady today due to a royalty dispute, which, you know, we'll hope gets resolved. Um, I was thinking, and I'm probably wrong, but I was thinking, what if um, Fougere Gothic gets even better if you put a bit of night music into it? And I don't mean any night music, I mean, I mean night music from Barrister and Man. Another soap that everybody loves. Actually, very few people <laughs> like night music. I've, I've got it here, the soapy soap. I'm using a, a brush from Frank Shaving. This is uh, Friendship Shaving Tribute brush with a synthetic knot. This one is called Macy. Yeah, still looks, so, smells the same, mainly mushrooms. <laughs> you know what, I'm going to read you Going to read you the scent notes. I didn't do that last time because the list is so damn long. So I need my grandmother reading glasses for that. No, I haven't purchased new ones. Okay, so in Fougere Gothic, they are lavender, oak moss, bergamot, geranium, sandalwood, smoke, mushroom, ash, tonka bean, fir, vetiver, cedar, musk, leather, and tuber tuberose. So, anything. And in night music, you've got musk, vanilla, bergamot, iris, iris, and strawberry. So, more sweetness, more darkness. Um, I mean, basically, night music is vanilla and musk with a, with a twist, and that twist is Iris, bergamot, and strawberry. So this is a hard soap, so let's try and make sure we get everything out of there. It smells so strange. Yeah, like a cellar. It's some, something, you know, Undertaker would smell like if he works, if he gets too involved with the job. <laughs> okay, I think that's that's enough. I'm going to add a bit of water to the bowl. No, I'm not doing that because I'm not bowl leathering. I forgot. Because I don't know how to bowl leather. I keep forgetting that. So so it's, it's half a leather, half a leather, okay. Such a good soap. Lots of soaps are good, aren't they? It's ridiculous, this soap is ridiculous. I'm not gonna say it smells good. It's more interesting than good, but it's, I mean, who the hell would think of such a crazy blend? And it's not by accident either, it's, yeah, it's on purpose. Very eerie. Oh, I was gonna put, what am I doing? I was going to put night music into it. So I have aftershave and the perfume from, from Nightmare. Let's do this. Probably a very bad idea. But you don't necessarily want to put you know, fragrance oil or, or ED teas. I think this is onto your skin, so be careful with that. It's better to do it in the bowl. 
Okay, so the, the Undertaker's creepy transvestite boyfriend just came to visit. It gets madder and madder. Should have hallows in it as well. Well, this is nice. Of course, I really like to make music. Yeah, that was, a, that was a good combination. Maybe I used quite a bit of night music. It kind of took over. Very good lather. No, there still is a hint of mushroom. Good. You're all going mushroom. He's mad as a hatter. And yes, the Undertaker's second boyfriend, the Mad Hatter, just came in the door. Okay, lather is going everywhere. So we'll call that good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was, it was, it was actually good uh, dosage. The razor is Chevette from Philharmonica. I thought this was you know, a bit of a gimmick when I found it at a flea market in Buenos Aires. I, I think it's the right thing. The, you know, they actually made this. Cool. In it is a blade you get when you buy a leaf razor. And it's half half a half a DE blade. Yeah, the Undertaker's boyfriend, girlfriend, whatever. Well, my music isn't girly, but it's sweet. I like it. Good combo. Try it at home, kids. And this razor works well also. I mean, it's a blade holder. Oh, shit. Well, I had no pressure, so I didn't cut myself, but I felt something. Maybe it was a... Um, an imperfection. <laughs> Crazy good lather just keeps falling off the razor just the way I like it. Oftentimes when you try to mix scents, it, it doesn't turn out well. You know, there are, there used to be challenges where YouTubers tagged each other and, you know, blending, blending scents, blending soaps was, was a common tag. Well, we haven't done tags in a long while. Maybe we should start. Look. Mix your two favorite Paris or Man scents. This turned out really nice. Because you know, night music can be quite in your face. It's, it's very, very strong. This this blend makes it milder. Okay. Lathering disorder. And 
you know, the earthiness from Fougere de Fique is there. I'm most pleased, most happy. Dosage, I don't know, you saw what I did, and it was like three proper little sprays. Of course, better to spray into the bowl where you're loading, because then you can also sniff it and sort of control the dosage. Yeah, really good scent. And equally interesting, I'm taking my aloe block out, wetting the fingertips and put them on the aloe. I tell you every time, but it's good advice, I feel. So when you shave with the shavette, you want to have an extremely light touch, even lighter than with a straight razor. Um, and even as I do that, I feel I quite often shave too close to the blood. So without knowing how, after a while I see blood coming up. But as little pressure as you can. That wasn't quite enough, actually. We do a, a frank backhand stroke. Frank is in Frank Strömberg, the late shark. Okay. So I'm a bit afraid to cut myself today and my hands aren't on their best behavior. Some days the hands just aren't there. Can you, do you have the same experience that sometimes it's just, ah, doesn't matter what I do. And I, when that happens, you want to go, or I want to go even more slowly, even more gently. This is a very raw feeling in the razor. It's like the, the razor barely holds the blade. And it kind of tells you, son, you're on your own. With that razor blade. Like the razor offers the blade up for you. <laughs> that was, I'm not even sure that was a good shave. I was so afraid of cutting myself. I, oh, what a, what a, what a cool blend. What a, I'm really happy. What a good blend. Very, very nice. So you have the strawberries, you have the mushroom. Vanilla is, is there. Because vanilla is always, if you put vanilla into fragrance, it's gonna be there. It almost doesn't matter how little you put in. Yeah, like I would know. Cool. I have night music, the aftershave. So I'm going to use that and afterwards, after a, a wee while, I'm gonna put the perfume on. What's wrong with the aftershave? Ugh. Oh, oh. Like an idiot. That, that was stuck, so I have heaps and heaps. Ah. Oh, burn. Fitting that burn.
Cool. It was Fougere Gothic soap. And I mixed with a bit of night music. Mm. Um, and it was great. Very happy. Very happy. Thanks for watching. Stay sharp.